to my channel. This is HBM Organic Beauty. <laughs> I opened a new channel recently and I want you guys to kindly please, I'm begging you, please support your girl. Go to that channel, go and subscribe. That channel is all about my family, it's all about my kids. At least, if you don't want to support me, have mercy on my kids, go and support them, please. Go and ginger them so that they'll be able to do more. Please, subscribe to my new YouTube channel. The name of my new YouTube channel is HBM and Family. It used to be Uche and Family, but I decided to change it to HBM and Family so that at least you guys will still know that it's HBM. Please, go and subscribe to that channel. Subscribe to the channel, view the videos, like the videos, help me grow that channel. You know I cannot do anything without you guys. Eh, please, help me to go and subscribe to that channel. Thank you very much and I love you. Mm -hmm. Okay, so today on my beauty channel, I want to, you know, I've been convinced about one soap. A particular soap like that. We all know the soap. I hope you all know what the soap is. This is Ghana White Soap. Yeah, they call the soap Ghana White Soap. But I've been wondering, what is the source of this soap? Because I would not say this soap is actually made with um, plantain, plantain bark. Because I, I know that our normal black soap, uh, the way it's been formulated, it contains uh, cocoa. I think cocoa, cocoa bud or something. It contains a plantain, plantain peel. It contains a shea butter. It contains, you know, a whole lot of herbal native ingredients. But this soap, they call it Ghana white soap. I don't know the source, but I, I, I want to believe that this soap actually contains sodium hydroxide. This soap actually contains lye. But because I don't know the source, you know, I am always scared most of the time to make use of this soap. Because I wouldn't want to be applying sodium hydroxide that has not been cured on my skin. So, um, yesterday I tried formulating my own. And this is my own white soap. So this is my own white soap. I have to do this with sodium hydroxide. I made it from scratch just the way I make my soap. So, I'll be showing you the process, the way I make this soap. But the main idea behind this soap is that... I actually make it so that I can use it as a soap base. Yes, we all use this soap, this Ghana white soap as a soap base. So, I made mine also that I'm going to have my own soap base. You know, most of the time you see some people's soap, you see that they, they, they prepared one yellowish, very yellow in color soap. Most time I see like pinkish in color soap. And let's be frank, that soap is always attractive. So I decided to make my own soap base. So that by the time this soap will cure, because I have to let it cure. Yeah, I cannot start, you know, uh, making soap. Or I cannot start adding my lightning ingredient into the soap. Because I know it hasn't cure. I cannot sell this kind of a thing to my client. Because, like seriously, so many people do. So many people, they don't send. Or they will just make everything sharp, sharp and sell. But I'm going to let this soap cure for a month before I proceed and do anything. Do wonders with it. So I'll be showing you how I made this soap. So if you've not subscribed to HBM Organic Beauty, my channel, this channel, kindly consider subscribing, like and share all my videos. And please don't forget to go and subscribe to my new YouTube channel. The link to my new YouTube channel is in the description box below. So just go to my description box, you'll see the link, just click, go watch. If you want to see the fun aspect of me, I'm a very funny person, you know, Beauty channel is all about being so official. <laughs> if you want to see my other side, the, the funny aspect of my life, my lifestyle. And please, before I forget, I just dropped a new video on that channel. I'm not going to be dropping videos on herb, herbs here because um, I want to make this channel strictly for formulation of skincare. So on that, my new channel, I'll be dropping so many DIYs. I just dropped a, 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 a good recipe, a recipe that actually worked for me after childbirth. Or now you can flatten your tummy. Or now you can burn your, the fat in your tummy. So please go and watch the video on that channel. Click on my description box and you will see the link to that channel. So go and subscribe and support my ministry. Okay, um, let's, let me show you the process how I made this soap. I'm going to be showing it to you guys. So just stay, watch this video to the end. 
and don't forget to like and share this video if you know the source of this ghana white soap if you know the way it's being prepared whatever it contains please i'm so much interested to know kindly drop a comment on what you know about this soap the preparation of this soap what it contains kindly kindly drop that in the commenting box because I'm waiting for that. Thank you. So I won't start making my soap, but I always make sure I have my apple cider vinegar with me whenever I'm making my soap in case of any accident. So why apple cider vinegar is very, very important for you is that whenever the lye or the sodium hydroxide I just peel on you, you know, just, you know, apply your apple, wash it off and apply your apple cider vinegar on wherever the lye has touched you or your skin so here's my sodium hydroxide yeah 300 300 and 11 this is my light bulb Please, at this point, make sure you cover your nose. my lactic acid So I want to stick blend till I will get a trace. This uh, soap actually contains a whole lot of um, olive oil. So that is why I'm not seeing the trace on time. I have to blend. But yeah, it's beginning to form a trace. I'm beginning to see the traces now. the ones I've molded this soap is super moisturizing because it contains moisturizing oils so it's not 
that very very strong like um you know the normal kogi soap we have in nigeria here you can see it's very very moisturizing so i can still reuse this if i want to use this actually i'm gonna show you guys how i'm going to use this so do not worry just make sure you stay tuned you subscribe you know what i'm saying you subscribe then turn on your notification bell so that by the time i come with another diy you're going to see the DIY. So here is my camera here on the chair here. That's my camera. Remember, guys, I want to sell that camera. Nobody wants to buy. Okay. Nobody should come and ask me. I want to start YouTube channel. Direct me on how to start YouTube channel. I want to start YouTube channel, but you don't want to buy my camera. So here is my white soap base. I'm going to let this soap cure. You can see. I'm going to let the soap cure. After this soap cures, then I will, I will make use of this soap. This is actually my base for now, but it has to cure. So guys, um, if you are new to this channel, do consider subscribing. Thank you very much. I'll be giving you updates. Updates. So if I want to make use of the soap, I will definitely show you guys how I make use of the soap. Thank you very much. Take care. Bye.